Well, pull up a chair and set a spell here at Tales from SYL Ranch, the vlogcast that reminds you to always know where your towel is. And I'm your host, Bill Stone. Today I'd like to come and talk to you about something different that I am doing on New Year's Day. I'm holding a five-hour charity live stream because I recently learned that one of my regular viewers has a brother who was a resident of Paradise, California, which you can now see behind me. He lost everything. And I had asked my viewer if there's anything I can do. Then I realized, well, I can do something. I have this platform. I can attempt to do something. So what I would like you to do is join me for this five-hour charity live stream because I'm going to try to raise some money, not only for this viewer, but also for other survivors of the Camp Fire. I'll also be doing a couple of reviews, non-spoiler reviews, of the Orville and Doctor Who, which will have its New Year's Day special, and the Orville will have been the night before. And I also may have some other thing baked into this, along with maybe some appearances by people who are interesting in the fanish world. But I want to talk to you about this, because this is something that's important for science fiction and fantasy and other genre fans. We have always been sort of an extended family for each other. Now, as the Fandai Master, I have witnessed this quite frequently over the decades. You can go back to when Robert Heinlein was alive, and Robert Heinlein had a severe medical condition when he was young. And so when he went to science fiction conventions, he would get science fiction fans by the hundreds to donate blood at blood donations. Now, this is who we are, and this is who we've been for a long time. Now, we may always disagree about our favorite film, our favorite TV series, our favorite story. Last of the Jedi is by no means the first time that people in fandom have disagreed. I can go back to the 1970s with Space 1999. There was an enormous amount of controversy over that. You can go back even to the original Star Trek series, because at that time literary science fiction fans dominated the world. And they rather thought that while Star Trek was better than the other science fiction on TV, it still wasn't all that good. So we will always argue, sometimes very emotionally. However, when the need arises, when the chips are down, we have never failed to help out our fellow fans in need. This is what we have been for more than 100 years, and we can be damned proud of it. So many years, Dave Livestream is going to be raising money for a charity to help these people get back on their feet. And I would ask that you join this live feed and that you tell all your friends, your family, your neighbors, your pets, and your livestock, and as well as many other fans as you can get, to please join the live stream. The more eyes I have, the more likelihood that we will get more money and the easier we will make some people's lives. Now, my time, if you know my regular show, the time is going to be a little different here. I want to give you a chance to get over your hangovers from the night before, maybe watch a little sports in the morning, and then I'm going to hold the live stream. It will be starting at 6 p.m. Eastern, 5 p.m. Central, 4 p.m. Mountain, 3 p.m. Pacific, and if you're working off of UTC, that'll be 11 p.m. Now, I want you to remember, and I want you to be proud we are fans, and when one of our own is down, we will always help them up. It's who we are, and it's who we've been for over a century. And that, my friends, sets us apart from everyone else among the stars. <laughs>